All right, guys, we're moving on to station B. Now, again, this station is still going to be set up in your kitchen or in your bathroom, somewhere that you have a sliding floor. That being said, we're going to revisit our ISO row. Now, with this first one, this is still going to be three exercises. We're going to be doing three rounds. First round through is going to be 20 seconds at all three exercises before we move on to the next round. This ISO row, rather than having elbows nice and close to the side, we're actually going to move the elbows a little bit forward so we've still got a little bit of that bend in through the elbows, but you don't have elbows tight to the side. Same position, 20 seconds, ears in line with the shoulders, hard pull, hard as you can, going for that 20 second full burst, and then after that 20 second, recover. Second exercise would be going on to the hamstring curl. This is going to be lying face up in your kitchen. We're going to start heels about a foot away. Drive the hips up into that full extension, coming up onto the shoulders. From here, I'm going to be sliding the heels out. Try to go as one unit and then pulling in, driving the hips up as you do. Now, this might be a large amount of force on through the hamstrings. So if that is too much, stabilizing in through the arms. I can just slide on out, lengthening under tension, dropping the hips down as I do, bring the heels back in, pop up, and repeat. Still keeping in mind this is going to be 20 seconds, so you might only get three to five exercises, still focusing on keeping that brace position. After that, you would go on to the third exercise, which is going to be the plank stand, or sorry, the plank can stack. This is we're gonna need three to four Canned goods. We're going to go into a plank position. From here, I'm going to be taking the first can, stacking it in front of me, reaching over, grabbing the opposite side, reaching over, dating a stack. After that, we would unstack, replace, opposite side. Trying to keep the hips in line the entire time, realizing that 20 seconds will go by quickly. After that, you get to recover for a little bit. Start on round number two, which is going to be 30 seconds per exercise. Now again, you can be inventive for this if you want to change up the stack or just be moving the cans from one side to the other. That's completely fine. Remember that the second round would be 30 seconds and the third round would be 40 seconds for all three exercises. After this, we're going to be going through station C.